specifically on Game Banana, where you can get Smash 4 mods. There is Cave Story Plus on the- what the heck? That is so jank, did you see that? Hey yo, hi guys, it's Mario here, and I hope to save room for dessert, because I've got another sweet video coming your way. And today, I'm here, without further ado, with another Super Smash Bros. Brawl mod showcase. So, it's been a while. Luffy, okay, um, I'm gonna change it. Um, yeah, it's been a while since I've done these, and my last Brawl mod showcase, and only Brawl mod showcase, got a lot more views compared to the Smash 4 mod showcases, and a lot more requests to do another one. So I'm here with another one, and this isn't the only reason why I'm doing a Brawl mod showcase. Um, I very much prefer Smash 4 mod showcases when it comes to like vertex hacks and texture hacks, but when it comes to PSAs, Brawl is better because Smash 4 doesn't really have that much of that yet. So I was trying to look for a quote from Cave Story mod in Smash 4, but I couldn't find any. Maybe because the fan base of the game is dead already, I don't know. So yeah, I only found one in Brawl, so that's why I'm doing it. And yeah, so this one has five different skins. It replaces the first, second, fourth, fifth, and sixth. I don't know why it skips the third one. I guess the creator of the mod just, just like Luigi's third skin, I don't know. But yeah, so as you can see also, I have a different mod pack. Um, so called Super Smash Bros. Infinite, as you can tell from the beginning of the video. Um, yeah, because the creator of the last mod pack I used uh, decided to take down the download and cancel it. So I decided to res respect his decision and not showcase that mod pack, show the mod pack in this video. So yeah, and even in this mod pack, the quote mod isn't in here. Like, as you can see, it's just all Luigi. So you have to install it manually, and it does not have any CSP, so that's why it only shows Luigi on here. So, yeah. So yeah, without further ado, let's get started. So I'm actually gonna do a stage from Cave Story. So the creator of this mod pack does recognize Cave Story, but for some reason he did not include the quote mod. Maybe he doesn't know about this quote mod. So, yeah. Oops. <laughs> oh, wow. And it's playing Moon Song. So I'm just gonna showcase the moveset. And this is a Vertex hack, like I said before. So this does not have any custom moves, sadly. Um, yeah. Um, if you haven't played Cave Story, you haven't heard of it. Play it right now. The original version, not counting the remakes, of course, is completely free, and you aren't really missing much if you play the um, free version. Um, in the free version, the original version, it's literally the full game. It's not a demo or anything. The creator of the original version decided to keep it free, and it's only one person, by the way, so that's an amazing achievement. And in 2004, when there wasn't really that much good technology, um... Yeah, you have the main story and everything. The only thing it doesn't have is the extra modes. Um, yeah, and if you're on the Wii or if you have if you have extra money and you're and you have a computer, which, which you should have, if you can install mods. Then you can go on Steam and play the remake, Cave Story Plus. It has 16-bit graphics instead of 8-bit. I know, big difference, but it does have the extra modes. So does the Wii Wii mode, Wii mode, um, the Wii uh, remake. It's in the Wii e Shop, the Wii Shop, Wii Shop channel, not on Wii U mode, sadly. So yeah, and you all own a Wii, so yeah. If you want the extra modes, and do that in 16-bit graphics. There's also Cave Story 3D, which has the most graphical advantage compared to everything else. It's just a complete 3D remake. And no, this model isn't from Cave Story 3D. This is actually a complete custom model, which is insane. Look at that. It even has eyes and everything. I don't know if it has facial expressions. Probably, yeah. That's insane. So I am dragging on way too much. I'm gonna showcase the moves. Yeah, I'm just showcasing my love for Cave Story. So this is neutral special, side special. I noticed in Brawl the, the misfires are like really high. It's hard to hit them. Okay, now down special. Actually, Kirby, get over here. This isn't a good place to showcase. Okay. Sorry, Kirby. I had to do this. All right. All right. So yeah, down special. I hate it, like, all the moves aren't guaranteed to hit. All the hits of the down special in Brawl. Alright, now up special. This should kill him because he's super light, freaking Kirby. Low survivability. But he's still my main iron anyways, so... Yeah, Kirby. Okay, now the A attack. Jab. Side tilt. Dash attack. Now down tilt. Oh no, Kirby's over here. No, get back here. Alright, down tilt. It can trip. Shoot, he was invincible. Okay. <laughs> All right. Now up tilt. Combo starter maybe. Combos and brawl. What is that? Oh shoot. 
Uh, I hate the classic controller pro. Alright. Yeah, I can't use the GameCube controller because the Wii U can't use GameCube controllers in Wii Wii or Wii mode. If you don't know what that is. So, yeah, now with the aerial. So, Nair, this knocks opponent up. So you can. Yeah, it's really good. It actually can kill. Yeah, there. That does a lot of knockback, actually. If it's sweet spots, of course. Alright, so forward air. This is a good combo starter. So you can do down throw the fair. Even at high percents, wow. Alright. Now dare. This can spike. And if it's sour spot, it just knocks them away. I don't know why I'm explaining the moves. Okay, back air. When they're not custom. <laughs> Alright, and now up. Up air. Shoot. Can you can't hit from behind. Okay, no, I want to do up air. Okay, why? I hate this controller. <laughs> okay, no. This is pretty awkward. Okay. Get up here. Okay, screw it. You can see it right here. <laughs> okay, smash attack. Forward smash. He's dead. Oh, we're all Kirby voice. Up smash. Down smash. Now the grab. Okay. Down throw. Forward throw. Oh, shoot. Back throw. I'm not used to these controls. Sorry. <laughs> That's why I keep shielding instead. And up throw. Shoot. Alright. So yeah, those are all the moves. Actually, the taunts. Down taunt. Up taunt. And side taunt. Alright, now I'm going to do the final smash. It's the same thing. Everything's the same. I. It's so sad that there's no... Um, what is it called? There's no PSA for this. But then again, K-Story isn't really that popular, so... Negative zone, and the music awkwardly stops. And Kirby's sleeping voice. Oh my gosh, that actually could kill! What the heck? This is the non-canon thing. I don't even know why Luigi has negative zone, but... Whatever, it's just completely out of place. Alright, so that's everything. So I'm gonna do a few matches with this. And the first time, I'm gonna do Outer Wall because it's fitting. And... Yeah, oh! Yeah. Um, I forgot to showcase the custom skins. I'll probably, with my magical editing skills, I'll just showcase on them on the screen right now. So, yeah. I'm not gonna showcase the moveset for them because it's gonna drag on way too long. But you guys get the point. So, yeah, actually with this, I'm gonna showcase the second skin. And just go in order with that. Alright, so I'm gonna go 1v1s. And maybe do other ty types of battles. And Quote vs. Sans, alright? The battle of the indie games. Um, I haven't played Undertale, so if you guys want to click off the video right now, I actually am not, I'm not part of the fan base yet. So, yeah. But Cave Story is comparable to Undertale, like a lot. By the few fans that are Cave Story fans. Wait. Okay. No, wait. Oh, I keep forgetting to do this. Okay. I slightly changed the controls, so I have to change my name tag. All right, now outer wall. Outer wall. I keep forgetting to do that. I, because I'm, I, I hate the class controller pro controls. So I, I decided to modify them a little bit. Yeah, start up with dash attack. Every noob does that. Okay. Well, I mean, dash attack is really good. Oh, be careful of the ledge thing, because there's that has the brawl ledge mechanics. I meant to do up tilt there, but screw this, this controller. Okay, fun fact with this controller, if you want to do like, if you jump. There's like a few frames where you, the buttons become unresponsive with the Classic Controller Pro. It sucks. What the heck is that? I don't know his character's moves that actually. Or no, know what his role is in the Undertale games. Um, yeah, there is a few frames where you can't do things. So if you're trying to do down throw to forward air, you can't do that in low percents. It's really hard. And I went to do an up smash there, but... Yeah, this is why also why I'm reluctant to do Brawl Mod showcases. Get over here. Don't be afraid. Because of this horror, horror controls. What is this? I'm losing to... A skeleton. Spooky scary skeleton! There we go. Punish. Yeah, oh, that could have killed in Smash 4 probably. I don't know. I'm, I'm not a master of this. Oh, so hard to do this. 
So the joystick is actually slightly out outwards more compared to the GameCube controller, so I'm not used to doing like a dash dance or whatever it's called. See, I can't do it. There's like a huge short delay, actually. No, actually... Wait, what am I saying? No, there isn't a short delay. Because I'm using the... The Wii Remote. Okay, this is kind of weird. Um, I'm not sure if this really is the issue. That sound is scary. I thought it would instant kill. Um, I'm not sure if this is the issue, but... When I use... Connect the... Classic Controller Pro with a Wii Remote without a Motion Plus. Because I assume that the Motion Plus ones don't work in the Homebrew channel, but that I was wrong. Um, there is a delay, but when I connect it to one with a Motion Plus, there isn't, so it's weird. Like, you can do it. Occasionally you can do it, but not always. It's, it's weird, I can't explain it. You can do, like, jump. You can do something right out of, out of jump. Or just some brawl mechanic that I don't know of. Oh my gosh, that move is strong. I'm gonna die. Just need to land a freaking grab. Sayonara! <laughs> okay, that was close. Okay. So, since there's five skins, I'll probably do five matches. And that was quick. Um, so... Fourth skin. Alright. And actually... Should I do a 1v1? Okay, one more 1v1, because I'm so used to them. Um, which character should I do? Probably... Pr Beautiful Joe. I should do Mega Man. I mean, they're both robots. Which... Yeah, Mega Man has his move set from Smash 4, which is really cool. Um, what level was I looking at? Um, there was a Dr. Mario level, but I don't remember where it was. No, I think it was... No, it was on the second page, right? Oh, oh well, I can't find that level. Actually, hold up. Yeah, this, this thing is hard to get around. There's like so many stages that I can't even fit. Tetris, doo doo doo. I can't find it, whatever. Uh. I think it's this one? No, this, this, this one, yeah. This one, alright. Yeah, this is a tourney friendly stage. Hey, me channel music. Oh, yeah, he can spam that a lot with this PSA hack. Why? At least make him faithful. And we're both blue, that's really cool. Pretty much a coincidence. And there's a blue pill right there. Oh, never mind, this isn't tourney friendly. I completely forgot about those pills. Yeah, I literally glanced over this stage, like I played it and looked at it. Just to look for stages to play during this recording. And that was a mistake doing that. <laughs> but I guess everything doesn't have to be tourney friendly. I mean, I'm bad at this game. There's no way I can play competitive Smash. I suck. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, God! Oh, the computers always air dodge after that. It's like they're programmed to air dodge after that move. They always do it. Oh, shoot! Okay, I grabbed the ledge. What the heck is this? Okay. Okay, they all disappeared. Oh, gosh, that's a lot. There we go. I want to do a back air, but whatever. Oh shoot! No, 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 don't punish. I just want to get the down taunt off. That's my favorite taunt in the entire game. Oh, that would have been good if I sweet spotted that. I kind of wish there was a PSA hack with quote. I really wish that would happen. I actually thought of a moveset for him. Um, you probably saw that comment if you did. It was a really detailed comment, comment actually. I commented on a couple of Cave Story and Smash Bros. related videos of it. Because I was so proud of it, I don't know. I can't grab- What? I'm facing the wrong way, what the heck? Okay. So yeah, it, it wasn't cool, but sadly Cave Store doesn't really get that much recognition. Actually, on Game Banana, where you can get Smash 4 mods, there is Cave Story Plus on- the What the heck? That is so jank, did you see that? Okay, there's a glitch in the stage apparently. Well, still, I'm gonna still win. Because I am the boss with Luigi. Literally, because there's a Luigi main called Boss. I think, I don't know, I'm not really that much into competitive team. 
Dang it. They always air dodge. Why? What was that? Bye. Oh, he's still alive. Okay, let me get this off. Let's get this. Okay, no, he's gonna be too high. They always air dodge when doing that. Why? I'm facing the wrong way. What am I doing? I'm just so not used to these controls. I'm just not. I heard of the Hori battle pad. Okay, this is kind of glitched up. Maybe this, this is one of the reasons why the creator of this mod pack did not include quote. Because of this glitch, but whatever. It, it only applies to the victory screen. Uh, I heard of the Hori battle pads. Um, they're basically classic controller pros. They, the, the, the Wii thinks that it's a classic controller pro. But it really isn't. It's actually a GameCube controller that you can attach to a Wii remote. So you can also use it in a Wii. Um, I don't know if I should buy one. Um, I'm kind of broke at the moment, but yeah. Okay, yeah, here's when I'm not going to do a 1v1, so. I'm not used to these, so I'm probably going to lose right now. Rip my throne. And I'm going to do Barman. Maybe freaking Knuckles, I don't know. Uh, Taboo is kind of overpowered, but. Not freaking Goku. I mean, no anime characters. I mean, I did Goku in the last... Okay, um, you know what, just, 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 let's just do Vegeta, why not, because we did, I did fight against Goku, and not Vegeta. Okay, so, what was the other stage I, I was looking at? There was a good stage right here, oh, over here, um, no, not this one. Okay, oh, it's here, here, uh, Coconut Mall, so let's just do that. So, as you can see, there's like buttons. Z and all that stuff. So you have to hold the button while pressing A to do that. And this is a green skin. It's really cool. So yeah, there's a free movement. It's really cool how this stage has this program. Unless it's just a model import, then yeah. Then yeah, the creator of the stage did not have to do that much effort to show that. Because usually with a free camera angle, if you look behind this, if you look, turn, do it, uh, if you do a 180. Um, it's just black there. This stage is pretty awkward, it's just flat. Oh, I meant to mash the button, whatever. I'm not doing my specials a lot, actually. I should really do that, to fend off opponents. You know, yeah, let, let them have their cluster truck over there. <laughs> let me see if I can get the misfire, even though it's not gonna land anyways. What are you doing? Oh gosh, oh gosh, that is overpowered as heck. I mean, it's a Dragon Ball character, what do you expect? I mean, they somehow managed to get Goku in Smash Clash 2 and make him balance. So, yeah. Also, Rip Vegeta in Super Smash Clash 2. I haven't really watched anime that much. Th that is a weird hitbox. It hit me from behind, did you see that? That's what she said, but... Oh, uh, I'm way too immature. I knew it would bounce off, but whatever. Oh, actually, I did fight against Knuckles. What am I saying? What am I doing right now? I fought, fought against Knuckles in the last episode. I just completely forgot about that. No. Punish. No, I want to do Uppy. No. I should have punished that. Are you serious? He's gonna kill me now. You know, I'm trying to play Super Smash Bros. Brawl, but this one player keeps kicking my ass. Oh, I completely missed that. Are you serious? And memes aside... Um, it'll be funny if you actually got that ad on this video. Ugh. Oh, I'm way too dangerous to close to here. And we are all at high percents. Uh, you know what, let, let them do the work. You know, just, just stay here. And do my crawling. <laughs> this actually looks funny in the quote. Oh shoot! Frick, I'm dead, I'm dead. So, um, what I said before was that this mod is not in this mod pack, I'm dead. No, no, no. Oh, okay! That is freaking insane! Okay. I'm gonna die here. Frick! Oh my gosh, that, that would've done a lot of damage. Um. Um, like I said before, this mod isn't really in the mod pack. I want to do an I'll smack or whatever. I'm gonna die. Ugh, ugh. Okay, that would've been funny if I fell off the stage. 
Uh, this mod isn't in the mod pack, so I decided to install it myself. And I was originally gonna do a brawl mod showcase, like this mod, this mod alone. Like I didn't install a mod pack alongside it, so it would have been kind of boring actually. Oh yes, thank you, stage jankness. And you didn't get the experience of this if I just installed the mod alone. <laughs> Oh shoot, what is it? Okay. Okay, so we did the first, second, third. Okay, now the fifth and final scan and the final game for today. So I'm gonna do a 1v1 for this because this is a more intense thing. Actually, yeah. And, and, and that's what I'm used to. That was just luck right there. So, uh, what should I fight against? Huh. Um, Dark Samus, maybe? Well, there's some guy in the comment section, um, I, um, really suggested me to do this mod, this Dark Samus mod, and I might consider doing it, actually. I really highly consider doing it. Actually, it's probably next on my list. So, the person who suggested this, probably gonna leave, like, something on the screen right now. I got you, fam. Alright. Um, maybe Mega Man X? Yep, yeah, just fight against Dark Samus, I mean. Yeah, I mean, just... It's just for that one guy, because he's probably salty that I didn't do a Dark Family Showcase in this episode. So I guess you can see a taste of what's potentially going to be in the next episode. So I'm going to do Wily Castle. Three, two, oh, yeah. That is an awkward an animation. Okay. Oh, this is not a good thing to showcase. I'm going to walk away. This is actually really cool. It's white. Oh, by the way, this is a huge attention to detail. See this hat? It says Curly Brace on it. That is huge attention to detail right there. Because if you don't know, the hat does is supposed to say that. It doesn't say that in the games because obviously the original and the most of its remakes are 8-bit and 16-bit. And even in Case Story 3D, the the one that is not 16-bit or 8-bit that has 3D models, I don't think that has curly based on the hat either. This is kind of laggy. I just noticed that. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, this is actually pretty laggy. I don't know what this guy does or a girl, Dark Samus. In fact, I don't know much about the Metroid games. I'm doing a let's play of Metroid Prime Federation Force, which I will probably can discontinue. Because it's Met Federation Force out of all games to start. <laughs> yep, yeah, this is slow as heck. Like, this is slow for brawl standards. Let's see what I did there. Let me at least get one down taunt off. Not down taunt off. I want to get that off. They always air dodge, of course, when I do that. Why Why do I bother doing that? I don't know. Oh gosh, okay, that was actually a good read. Right there. I like his, her rolls. I keep saying his. I can't believe I'm not dead yet. Yep. Okay, stop rolling. What, what is that? Okay! Or at least one up B off. Like, right there. Oops, I accidentally raised the volume. Right here. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, I accidentally... I'm wearing headphones right now. And I accidentally raised the volume. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm gonna die. I still have my double jump. Misfire? Oh, that is a misfire, but it's too high. As you can see there. Yo, I'm just gonna spam this. Oh, that was so close! No! Uh, we need to have at least one of these in this episode. Really? Yeah, kill me. I don't really care. This, this platform's gonna save me? I can't believe I'm still alive. Okay, there. I'm dead. Yeah. I should've died there. I love this music. Oh, I shouldn't have teched into that. Uh, oh gosh, she's going really all in now. Stop. It's time to stop. No. Please, have mercy. <laughs> she saw I, I tried to disrespect her with that downtown nation. This is it. This is it, my boy. Okay. It goes too high, her recovery. I can't do it. She has to be like really below the stage. That should have been a punish. I could have killed her right there. Hmm. 
I'm gonna die. Oh, frick! Okay. What, what did I just do? Actually, that... I'm gonna die. Please, no. Like, this could have been a flawless victory. There we go. I didn't get the downtown off or whatever. I really want to get that off. But well, whatever. And this is the great, greatest victory pose of all time. So congratulations, you've reached the end of the video. Want to see more? Check out my channel for more gaming content. Like this video if you liked it. And subscribe to join the Smarmy today. I'm Smario, and I'm signing out. And don't forget to leave your suggestions in the comment section below. Um, obviously, I might be doing Dark Samus in the next episode. But that doesn't mean that your request won't be noticed. So, yeah. Bye, guys.